The Mexican and American War was fought over land. It started because there were 10,000 Americans and only 4,000 Mexicans living in Texas, and Texas was Mexican territory. Mexico signed a paper that said that people could settle in Texas, but when there were a lot of people that moved into Texas, there were not able to move any more people in. The Americans had to follow a lot of laws to live in Texas, and they could not do slavery. It made a lot of people mad, and they rebelled and fought at the Alamo. The Mexicans won the Alamo, but later the Texans won, and they were er, their own country. They tried several times to become a state of America, but they were denied because America would have an uneven number of slave states and non-slave states and they didn't want to make the Mexican government mad. They made a deal with Britain and got another state eight, uh, up in the west and, and then they could get Texas and then they joined in. Texas was now a state. When President Polk was president, he wanted America to be a nation from sea to sea, and he wanted to buy California. The people voted for Texas to be a state, and that made Mexico mad. They would not sell California, and they attacked some parts of the U.S. Mexico was not up for fighting, and America had a better, better military and since America was already trying to get more land, they, they took one third of Mexico's land and is part of the U.S. today. But when the Mexicans were attacking America, it gave America a chance to take that land and it made Mexico mad and they called it an unjust war. So the videos I found that to help me learn about this subject were the Spanish-American War and um, what was the American and Mexican War or um, history from the History Channel.